Hello, please ignore my hair. It is windy all the time out here now. It's been so windy this year. Oh, this is my little, it's kind of a pond. It fills up, yeah, I'm drinking it truly. It's Friday, I've had a long week. <laughs> um, but this is like, I would call it like a seasonal pond. It's really small and only when it rains a lot does it fill up, but there are crawfish all in there. And if I wasn't in flip-flops, I'd go out there and see if we could see some. Look at the sun. Well, the sunset's pretty much gone, but the sky is still pretty. Look at that. <sighs> so I'm doing the garden update. I'm telling you, the wind is just ridiculous. Has anyone else noticed that where you live? I don't know about y'all, but in Texas, the wind is crazy. Crazy. It's been crazy this past, like, all year, really. Um, so this is the garden. And all of these, this whole row here, is all uh, peas. And they're doing really good. Like, they're doing awesome. They're starting to get little buds on them, which I think must be a good sign see that one has some and I'm gonna get some trellises out here so that they can climb the trellis this is like a really random we thought it was a we got it with a group of tomatoes but it's clearly not a tomato we can't figure out what the heck it is but it's like kind of like really thick maybe it's like a mutant um, tomato but those are all tomatoes um, this one is peppers. I'm not sure what kind. This is what my boyfriend's dad planted. Um, I would go down this row, but I got mud all over myself when I went last time. Um, but I've got some spinach and lettuce growing on that row. I'm so excited because I, I'm, I've got a bunch of spinach, um, growing and I juice and um, put spinach in smoothies like several times a week so I'm so excited to be able to do that with my own spinach but I've got two I planted a bunch of lettuce and it just once I transplanted it it just didn't really work except these two did they're hanging in there this one I mean it, I, it doesn't look that healthy and then there's this one and like it's it's trying they're trying what else do we have out here i'm so tired more peppers these are different kinds i'm not sure i think these might be cayenne i don't know more peppers and then corn so corn here and here these are all onions this is all onions both of these rows and this is garlic right here in this row and this is a watermelon plant we planted three and only that one has survived and it's not doing too hot <sighs> which makes me sad because I really want watermelon but I think they just need more some, this soils too you know, it's clay soil, so it's just not thriving. Um, but look, this is on the tops of the onions. I guess that's going to be a flower. I don't know. I don't know anything about onions. Um, but where to put my can? <sighs> it's been a long week. You know, I went to my parents. And helped them with that which was great i love being able to do that with them but it's a lot of driving and then today all day i was showing houses um an hour and a half north of where i live so it's like driving shouldn't be exhausting but it kind of is i guess because you're always because you're always on alert and this stuff came up overnight Actually, over day. It wasn't here this morning. Like, I don't know. Stress. Not stress. I'm not really stressed out, but probably not eating 
healthy enough. Whatever. Um, but I'm gonna show y'all. It's probably too dark over here, but I've got my, I just love it out here. My boyfriend's dad, Senor Martin, um, he, now that it's spring, everything is growing. The grass and everything is growing so much, so fast. Um, pretty much every day he's out here on the tractor mowing different sections of the property. So today I thought it was so sweet. I came home and this, he mowed like this little section where I had put a little birdhouse out and he made a little pathway beside it. I thought that was so sweet. Right here. It's, yeah, right there is like a little pathway and the birdhouse is right over here. I was like, oh, that's so nice. But this is the birdhouse. I'm sorry it's so windy. wind chimes. I have these wind chimes. And then I got this this weekend college station. You can't really see it's a horse. They don't blow that much. The horse one doesn't really blow that much, but this is my little sanctuary space. I don't know if you can really see it. I don't know how to turn the camera around. I'm gonna cut this short because it's so windy, but I just thought I would do a little update on my garden <laughs> and life. And tomorrow I'm going back up to the McKinney area to show the same clients some more houses. Um, they put their house on the market yesterday and they've already gotten offers, cash offers. So I'm like, okay, we've got the momentum. They're gonna get their house sold. Where am I supposed to be looking? There, I think there. Oh, we've got momentum. They're gonna get their house sold. And I just feel like their energy is totally different. Like now that their house is on the market, they're like, oh my God, this is real. We really need to find a house. So I feel like the energy is just different and we're gonna find them a house. I feel it. Like if not this weekend, next weekend. But I'm hoping for this weekend. Okay, that's it for me. I hope you can hear something from this. It's so windy, but I will, I'll see y'all later. Have a good weekend.